staying in Italy and another true question here, which of the following is true of Franciacorta Setien? Does it need to be 100% Pinot Bianco, 100% Glera? Does it need a minimum of 18 months on the lees? Or does the pressure need to be less than five atmospheres? Okay, we're turning up the heat a little bit here on everyone with this question, so. A little obscure perhaps for some of y'all. So some people were not uh, daunted or undaunted by this and are saying pressure below five atmospheres. That is excellent and that is correct. Well done, y'all. Our Francia Corda is traditional method sparkling from Lombardy, of course. Satin in Italian means silk and this wine has less pressure than our traditional, traditional methods and that gives you that silky soft texture. So excellent. So more bubbles off the beaten path. Let's go up to England. So true or false, Southern England has chalky soil, much like that of Champagne. We have a lot of trues coming in uh, here, so most people saying true. Excellent. And y'all are absolutely correct. So England has that chalky soil that's virtually identical to Champagne. We're only about 80 miles away across the channel. And the photo in the background here is those iconic white cliffs of Dover, and you can see that white chalky soil right there. So good job. One more British bubbly question. Annual production of English sparkling wine. Are we looking at 4 million bottles, 7 million bottles, or 15 million bottles? Annual production of English sparkling wine. Yeah. Yeah, we have a lot of different answers here. So which one is the uh, which one is the correct one? It's seven million bottles. Um, in nineteen, excuse me, in twenty nineteen, about seventy two percent of English sparkling English wine production was sparkling, and that accounted for about seven million bottles. Only about 10% of that is actually exported though. So these wines might be hard to find in your markets, but I strongly recommend them. They are delicious. <laughs> 